These little songs make me glad to call you mine. And you have got my head in the clouds. Hey besties, welcome back to my channel. I heard a few Americans saying this, so I'm calling you besties now. And I know it's been a long time since I last filmed in English, so I'm here to make it up to you guys because this is a vlog in English, clearly. So welcome to my summer routine because it's so exciting to wake up and to be able to do the things I love, studying languages, watching Netflix, reading books. It's so exciting and it feels so good. You guys know it's been a busy year and I studied really hard and it was my last year of school and now I'm studying languages a lot because I'm not going to school anymore thankfully because I just couldn't take it anymore it was so exhausting so this is my routine now I woke up and I had breakfast I did some laundry I also watched a couple of videos in English here on YouTube and I love watching vlogs and if you're here, you're probably like me because you're watching a vlog right now. So um, I also listened to a podcast in French on Spotify. It was a French journal. I love listening to podcasts because I know it helps me a lot to improve French. I've been reading much more too. So I have to tell you guys that I read a book by Colleen Hoover last week and it was fantastic. And now I'm addicted to Colleen Hoover too. I never thought I would be one of those people, but now I am. I gotta buy more of her books, but I have a book by Colleen Hoover here on my bookshelf that I still haven't read. I guess I'm gonna read right now since we're talking about books, but it's not gonna be a book by Colleen Hoover because I know that if I start to read it, then I'm gonna want to finish it and I have to make this video for you guys so I can't spend my whole day reading so I'm looking to my bookshelf to search for a good book so I'm reading The Red Queen I don't know if it is the book's name in English but if we translate it to English it is The Red Queen so I'm calling it The Red Queen because you guys are seeing the book and you know what I'm talking about I'm on page 25 and it haven't interested me that much yet but everyone loves it so i'm gonna go on and i will give it a chance and i update you guys later so a little break right now because i gotta have a snack Now I'm gonna study French because I haven't studied grammar 
much this year and it's not that I think that grammar is essential for your studies but I do think that sometimes grammar can help you because I see myself a lot of times confused because I don't know something so if I know grammar then it won't scare me anymore so I do study grammar but not like every day please don't think that I study grammar every day because I don't it's really rare I just study it when I have like a question or a doubt but it's not every day let me give you an example so you don't think that I'm like a grammar person um I have a lot of questions about verb tenses in French because it really messes me up. So um, what do I do? I get this book and I study verb tenses in French because I know I can learn them just by contact and listening French. But I also know that if I learn the sentences, the structure, then I know I'm gonna learn it faster. It's totally possible for you to learn verb tenses just by listening, speaking, but it's also possible for you to learn verb tenses if you study grammar, if you write sentences, if you see the structure of the sentence. And this is what I'm doing right now because I know it'll help me to improve French faster, but I also know that I have to write and I also have to listen and to speak. So that way my French will really improve, but it's not like just one thing that will get you there. So guys, I was watching French classes and now I'm gonna use all of the apps I have on my phone for learning languages. Cake, Elsa Speak, Duolingo. There's another one that I use for French speaking and conversation, but I can't remember its name. I think it is French conversation, but I'm not sure. I like to take some time to use all of the apps I have because they really help me and I end up learning a lot of stuff. Another thing that I did, um, I switched the language of my Wattpad to French, so now I can read a lot of stories in French. I was thinking about doing this for a while now and I'm so happy that I did it. Hi guys, I'm back. I was using Elsa Speak and I shared the results of my level test on my Instagram stories and I'm so happy about it. It's almost night and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna read a little bit more because I stopped um, to study French and last night I started watching One of Us is Lying on Netflix and it's so good. Um, I highly recommend it to you guys because I stayed up late watching it. I just couldn't stop watching it. Um, it's so intriguing and it is crazy. It's awesome. So you have to watch it. If you haven't watched it yet, please do it. Before to go back to reading, um, I need to study Spanish. So I guess I'm just gonna use Duolingo. What's the English pronunciation for Duolingo? Duolingo? <laughs> I don't know, Duolingo, maybe that.
busy Sunday mornings hiding under covers. I don't mind staying in with you. Play your favorite movie, laying right beside me. I don't mind when it's just us two. The corner coffee shop we like to go. I know I said I was going to read, but I just can't, and I'm studying French again. Let me show you. La brièveté de ce chapitre n'empêche pas. Late night walks with you to take me home. With you, I never feel alone. These little songs make me glad to call you mine. And you have got my head in the clouds. Oh, one, two, three. All that I need is your body next to me on rainy days. Just need your company, don't need too much. Just your simple love and it's